Hey guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. If you are new here and you enjoyed today's video, please feel free to hit subscribe. But today I am filming something that I feel like I should have done a long time ago. One of my most asked questions is always on any of my videos. Where have you got your jeans from? What are your favourite jeans? What style jeans are you wearing? So I thought I would sit down today and I've basically just pulled out all of my favourite style of jeans from my wardrobe and I'm going to go through them with you guys and I will also insert some try on clips so you can see exactly what they look like on but I will also link every single item down below in the description. Like I say I have pulled them out of my wardrobe so I do already own all of these. I wear every single one of them literally all the time so I wanted to share them with you guys but without further ado I'm going to start with the pair that I wear the most. I've just moved over to this side so I can insert the try on clip here but the first pair I wear these literally almost daily like honestly these are my go-to pair and they're the ones that I get the most questions on my two most worn are from Topshop so both are actually also the Jamie jeans these are the newest pair that I got so they are a skinny jean they nip you in so so nicely at the waist and they are super high-waisted which is what I love I think they now actually do Joni jeans that do have belt loops I may be completely wrong but if I'm right I will link a pair down below because they are the most comfortable jeans you will ever find like honestly so ridiculously comfortable but the thing I liked about this style is that they have this frayed hem to them So they have a load of distressed detail going on here and it does have that on both legs I don't know why I just really like what this looks like I honestly think these were more expensive than the ones that don't have a distressed hem Which is kind of crazy because you're literally paying more for them to destroy them But yeah, this is the pair that I'm wearing the most at the moment So my second most worn pair like I said before are also some Topshop Jamie jeans Literally the only difference with these ones are that they don't have the frayed hem at the bottom So these are the first ones that I picked up. This is the style that I've worn for the longest. I think I've gone through only two pairs of these over around four or five years. So they do last quite a long time. Obviously, if you invest in jeans like Levi's, they're gonna last you a lot longer, but they are pushing about a hundred pounds, I think. And I just can't justify spending that much on one pair of jeans. But then to be fair, I do think Topshop jeans are a little bit overpriced as well. I think these are around 38 to 42 pounds. I can't remember exactly how much. I will leave the prices and the sizes that I wear each piece in on the try on clip. So make sure you're looking out for that if you you are wondering also for reference with that i am typically a uk size 10 and i'm around five foot six so yeah these are such a stable pair and again obviously they have the belt loops with the moon jamie jeans but they are just so comfortable i'm honestly obsessed with topshop jeans they are my go-to when anyone asks me where i get my jeans from it's always topshop even for mum jeans or straight leg jeans they have some really good ones i also just really like the way they do their sizing because you can pick your waist and your leg length so it's so easy to find a pair that will fit literally perfectly so this is a pair that i mainly reach for for a night out I usually pair these with like a lacy bodysuit or I really like how they look with a little bralette and a blazer thrown over the top. They are just some of the most flattering jeans. So they are straight leg, but they have a really tight waist to them. Again, they are super high-waisted, which is why you can easily get away with pairing these with a little bralette. These are from Rebellious. They are so, so inexpensive. I do think though that various websites sell jeans from this brand. So this is the brand itself. I don't want to butcher the name. Like I say, I feel like they are sold on various different online sites, but I did pick these ones up from Rebellious, so that is what I'll link in the description. These ones do have a little detail with a rip on each knee but they also do have this style without the rip so if you don't like the distressed detail then there is that option and I definitely want to pick them up because I feel like they look a little bit more dressy. They are super super long as well like I say I'm around five foot six and these do drag on the floor if I wear them with trainers but if I wear them with heels which is how I usually style them then I think they're the perfect length so yeah really happy with these. I actually bought George some straight leg jeans recently from Pretty Little Thing. I picked them up for a challenge that we did recently and they didn't have any rips in the knees so I'll link those ones down below if you like I say don't really love the distressed detail so another pair from Pretty Little Thing like I say a load of online sites sell this exact brand of jeans for some reason they are so inexpensive but they're just like the best quality but they're actually also a really soft denim that is super comfortable to wear so these are another straight leg pair with a really cinched in waist I just find these to be so so flattering and I feel like they'd flatter a lot of people the only detail is that they have this little slit at the bottom I love pairing these with my Balenciagas because I feel like they just sit really nicely over the shoe but also pairing them with heels it means that you can see your heel through this little slit so again I really love these I wear them so much on a night out but also they're obviously so easy to style for the daytime too so you will probably notice that almost all of the pairs of jeans that I have are the typical like blue denim I don't really wear black denim but that being said Topshop do have black Jamie jeans and Joni jeans and also Pretty Little Thing obviously have so many different styles on there which include black denim that being said though I do have one pair of my 
wardrobe and these are actually the exact same style of jeans as the one that I just showed you but obviously in the black denim which I really like because I do feel like black denim does dress up a pair of jeans so I do mainly go for these ones for a night out over the blue style like I say they are the exact same so of course they just go all the way down and then they have this little slit at the side here again it's super flattering I think these ones were actually from rebellious but I know that they sell them on pretty little thing they are the exact same brand of jeans that the other ones are made out of and I kind of want to find where they originally sell them from because they are just so good like I don't know how they get their prices so cheap but I really love all of their different styles and I think that they just fit so so nicely I know a lot of us which I'm hoping is why you might have landed on this video we all tend to struggle with like really good fitting jeans and I do feel like I found quite a few which is why I wanted to sit down and film this for you guys so hopefully it is a little bit helpful so this next pair I'm not going to be able to link down below because unfortunately they're from Primark and if you're from the UK you'll know that they are sadly not online so you will have to go into store to try and find these ones but I believe that they recently came back into stock so these are the Primark vintage straight leg jeans and again these are some of my most asked about jeans I wear them all the time in the summer and I do think that they come back into store around this time of year so I don't think they were on sale around the winter time which is why a lot of you guys couldn't find them but again they're a super high-waisted jean that is one thing that you might have figured out from me already from this video that I love high-waisted stuff I don't tend to wear low-waisted jeans or joggers or anything to be fair I just think high-waisted flatters me so much more and just makes me feel a lot more comfortable anyway so yeah super high waist and obviously have the belt loops again and then they are another straight leg jean but they're not as full length as the other ones Aisha and Zelia actually got me onto these and because they're quite small they're a lot smaller in height than me these do actually fit the girls full length but for me they tend to cut me off at around my ankle but I actually really like the style of them I think they look really nice over summer like I say I just live in these with little vest tops and maxi cardigans in the evening when it gets a little bit colder you guys probably know by now but yeah I definitely wanted to give these ones a mention because I think they're about 13 pounds they're so so cheap and I couldn't recommend them enough so I wanted to make sure you guys knew that they were back in stock and you can now get your hands on them okay technically this last pair isn't a pair of jeans per se but these are another absolute staple trouser that I always go to so I thought I'd include them anyway because again super inexpensive as you can imagine these are a pair of leather look trousers I think I got these ones from rebellious but I feel like I've looked on there recently and I couldn't find them so fingers crossed they're back in stock but if not I'll do some digging and I'll find some on another website for you guys I have had these for so long and I feel like I've literally worn them to death but they are still going strong and they still look great to be fair they honestly pair with everything and like I say they've just been such a staple in my wardrobe these are also a skinny style of trouser and they just go down all the way to my ankle and obviously they have no distressing on them at all but yeah leather look trousers are something that I was a little bit afraid of before I got them but ever since I've had them I've surprised myself and worn them so much more than I thought I would so a couple of other little staples these are kind of random but I thought whilst I was showing you everything else that I wear literally every day I might as well include a couple of other things so the first being the belts that I wear most often so this one is from Pretty Little Thing please excuse what it looks like it's looking a little bit worse for wear because I've had this for so long now and again like I say this is an everyday staple for me it's just a really simple design so it goes with literally everything so on the front here it has just a really simple square buckle and then my favorite detail is that on the back it has this little PLT logo and I just love it I think it's so so sweet this is basically a dupe for the YSL belt that has YSL on the back but I ain't forking out that much for a belt so I went for the pretty little thing one and it works just as well so yeah that is the first belt that I wear a lot honestly looking at these now I definitely need to invest in some new belts because these are looking like they've seen better days let's be honest so this is the other one that I get so many questions on and this is from White Fox I will of course leave this link down below and I've loved this for so long honestly it looks very questionable now because I've honestly worn it to death but I love the gold hardware on it and I love that it's a little bit more chunky but it's still very very wearable so yeah they are my staple belts that I wear most often but just really quickly before I round this video off another couple of favorites of mine if you guys know me at all is joggers <laughs> let's be honest as much as I wear these jeans a lot I do also spend most of my time at home editing or just working from home in general so when I'm not out of the house and I'm doing exactly that I will be lounging around the house in joggers so it is something that I also get a load of questions on so I thought I'd just quickly include it in this video I literally get all of my joggers from Pretty Little Thing and there are two staples that I wear I've actually got someone right now so these are the casual joggers and they have them in literally so many different colors but they're high-waisted they cinch your waist in they skim really nicely over your hips and then they cuff at the ankle they are just so flattering yet they're so comfortable I just find that most comfortable joggers 
joggers are like really oversized but they just drown you and don't do anything to flatter your body shape whereas the pretty little thing ones i don't know what they've done with them but they are literally the best shape and are so flattering yeah they have the casual joggers which like i say i have on right now and i get them in the ash gray color and then the other ones that i wear from them are their embroidered ones so they just have a little pretty little thing logo embroidered onto them and i also have a matching jumper for that because that is for the days of when i'm in ultimate comfort mode so yeah if you are also on the lookout for some really good joggers then definitely check out those links because they are some of my favorites and i feel like a lot of you guys will like them too but that is everything that i had to show you guys for this video like i said i just wanted to quickly sit down and film it for you guys because i get so many questions literally every day so hopefully it's helped you out and if you've seen anything that you have like the look of and you want to check out i will link it all directly down in the description so you guys can find the items super easily but yeah that being said i am going to wrap this video up here if you have enjoyed it please do feel free to hit subscribe but other than that thank you guys so much for watching as always and i will speak to you all very soon in my next one bye guys <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,